What is going on everybody, my name is Robert Watkin and welcome back to another tutorial. Once again we've got another YouTube tutorial here today. So in this one I'm going to be showing you how to add cards to your videos. Now cards are essentially little links that can show up on either mobile or on your computer, which you may have seen them before, they appear in the top corner of a video as like this little eye icon. You can click on them and then you'll get an option for some links. These can be very useful to promote other YouTube videos, other YouTube channels, or just anything really that you want to promote related to the video. Now getting straight into this guys, what you're going to want to do is click on your logo at the top here. You then want to click into Creator Studio, which will bring you to this page here. And once you are here, you want to go into your video manager. So now guys that you are on your video manager, you're going to want to find a video that you want to put a card on. Now in the past you may have seen that I've done it sometimes when I've been recommending other videos on my channel. So let's say I've been doing a tutorial on my channel and I am using a specific tool and maybe I've already done a tutorial on that tool in particular. While making that tutorial I may end up going also check out my other video where you can see this tool more in detail. And the link will be in the top corner of the screen. Something along those lines. Um, I hope that made sense. That was a bit confusing for me to say. But yeah, I hope that made sense. But it's a good way to promote other videos basically on your channel. And other stuff you just want to promote. Um, it doesn't have to necessarily be done like that. You can also just put them anywhere in a video. Which is what I'm going to show you now. So what I'm going to do is actually go into my most recent video. Which has gone up on YouTube. Which is how to delete YouTube videos. And we're going to click on edit. And once we've done that, we can see at the top we've got a few options. We can see cards is one of them. We want to click straight into that. What is going on, everybody? My name is Robert Walken and welcome. And then it'll start playing the video. We're just going to pause that for now. But this is the screen where you can add cards. If you've seen my tutorial on how to do end screens, uh, it's a very similar layout to that where you can add the cards on the side of the elements and then you've got your timeline at the bottom. And this is a perfect time to say, if you want to check out that video, click the card in the top right of the screen. Yes. <laughs> okay, now that you've seen that card in this video, I'm going to show you how to add the cards. Um, but you, what you want to simply do is find somewhere in the video you want to add one. So I'm going to go, let's say, so I'm going to go 20 seconds into the video here. And then I've got the cards at the top here. So if I click add card, we've got some options here. Once again, very similar to the end screen annotations. Um, so we've got video playlists where you can promote a video or playlist from your channel the actual channel itself so you can promote a channel but not your channel this is a link to a different channel um, so let's say you've got multiple channels then you can promote a different channel link uh, polls so if you want to do like a questionnaire type thing you want to get some uh, more participation in the videos then do a poll and if you want to add a link to a different website you can do that now bearing in mind not all links will work only certain links will work I'm not too sure which will but if you have a little play around you'll be able to find out quite quick but for this we're just going to do video or playlist. So we could click on here and what we could simply do is just add top 5 hotkeys to speed up your editing. So this was a previous video I made so we could just add that card, click create card and then there we go we've got that in. Now if we actually move back on the timeline a little bit here and then hit play for that setup so if i do i'll just put them in there um, but anyway, you see the card pop up in the corner of the screen so that's a way you can actually preview if it's worked also another thing i'd recommend doing is let's say this video is in a playlist which this one is this is in my youtube tips and tricks playlist then you may want to do something like add card video playlist and put on the youtube tips and tricks playlist so add add the relevant playlist so people can see where it's from or at least relevant videos and if they're already watching this video it is very likely that they may want to watch other videos of the same type of content and um, so i feel like that's a good way to also promote some channel content in a good way as well also if you do need to get more detail on screen if you can't quite see where you're going because of course the timeline is literally from here to here luckily i've got a short video here so it's not as much of a problem um, but if it is a long video you can use this little slider at the bottom and you can zoom in and get a lot more detail So that means we can just clearly see how far we're spacing the actual cards themselves Let's zoom back out here You'll notice there is no save button on the screen as well That's because all the saves occur on the screen automatically so you don't need to worry about that as well But that is pretty much it for this video guys if we watch this one more time just to see we'll play it and there we go suggested youtube tips and tricks if the user clicks on that they'll get this little menu that pops out where they can then click on 
the YouTube tri uh, tips and tricks playlist. That is going to be it for this video guys, so if it did help, please leave a like, consider subscribing, and if you would like to see any more tutorials, then just comment them down below, I'm always happy for suggestions. Uh, but yeah, that's it for this video guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video of whatever I make. Bye bye!